Hey, what's up? This is Minecraft Simple Houses. Uh, today's not really a house, really more of like a clubhouse type deal than like a home. But as you can see, we switched te texture packs. Uh, John Smith Legacy, I believe is what this one's called. And you can see this really changed. If you had been in the last video, you see how much different everything looks than the previous texture pack we were using. Um, which was, I believe in the last video, was the default. So let's go over to what we made today. Which is this is sort of a kind of a Vikingish slash farmhouse type of uh, just just really kind of a big you know meeting place is what I was trying to do. Gosh, I hate the rain. As you can see, I've had to do a lot of rain clearing, time changing today. Let's actually set the time earlier to. There we go. But yeah, this is a really cool texture pack, actually. It's pretty nice. I would recommend getting it. Uh, ooh, look at a little water. Yeah, so this is a courtyard. We built up this little lamp here, like kind of like a little light post. Uh, plus these giant doors. I didn't put actual doors on them just because there's none that big. And it actually kind of adds to the whole long house type of feel, even though it's really not designed as a real Viking architecture. Uh, I know someone's going to complain about that, but whatever. So, as you can see, there's no real living space. Um, and as I said, these videos are really just kind of to show uh, style and design features. Not really like a build this exact house type of deal. Um, as you can see, this, this window kind of mirrors this door in terms of width. And, the, and I went up a little bit in height, but I didn't want to do this giant window for... You know, it just really want to fit correctly. Um, I'm going to shut this door here. And then we have the lights on the ceiling. Very simple. You know, that's uh, glowstone. It, it looks like a lamp in the texture pack, which is really great. And then there's just this little thing on the side here, which is just like a little meeting room. So if you maybe were in a, a faction server or a PvP, you know, this could be an area for peace, like a truce area. And... You know, I won't come here and they could discuss, you know, maybe like, oh, you know, this area in this part of the map is going to be neutral or, you know, whatever. We're just going to share a mine. I don't know. You know, a lot of people are like, oh, that's stupid. But depends, you know, how many people are in the game. Um, and, and, you know, who's playing. I mean, different people have different ways of playing. Another great thing, though, is uh, the height is, I believe, seven blocks. So you can get a block overhead. And if you wanted to, I was thinking about it. I'm not sure if I wanted to do it yet for the video, though, because I would really kind of just, like I've said before, let you guys make it up on your own. You know, get some originality in there. Um, which is, you could build at the fourth block up over here, and still have three blocks up with a second floor. And then all you'd have to do is, is add lighting to the, uh, the bottom floor to make sure mobs don't spawn. And that's about it. And, um, and that would be, you know, you could put beds up there or crafting tables or whatever. And yeah. So then on the outside in the courtyard, um, we have this little path. Uh, we got a little nice little pond. We got a tree of peace. A little olive branch maybe, you know. You could say whatever the hell you want about that. Sugar cane. Cactus. You know, someone cheats, you go and shove that up their mouth. <laughs> um, for saying bad words. And then we have the lamps on top which provide a nice uh, light kind of going around the edge, um, which works well with the light over here, so it kind of you get a frame kind of around the whole edge of this, plus with the torches, really fills it up. Um, and then it also kind of illuminates the outside, which is matched by these uh, little porches. There's a porch at, I think, every door entrance, I believe, except for the, the ones on the interior of the, the wall for the courtyard. Uh, yeah, see, uh, and then this one has uh, seats. You know, say maybe you got some bodyguards and they want to sit outside, have a barbecue and chat while you do your meeting or whatever. You know, it depends, once again, who's playing, how many people are in a server, things like that. Um, and also maybe you're just bored and you're just building a bunch of a bunch of buildings in a single player. You know, you can do whatever the heck you want with this, it's all your thing. So keep it interesting. You know, maybe add some chickens in here, maybe a cow. Um, yeah. And uh, just in case anyone's wondering, um, well, not, I doubt anyone's wondering, but 
Uh, just for information, I'm currently just starting into getting into mods, and so if I can figure out what the heck it is I'm doing, I'll probably start putting some mods up on this channel, um, you know, if I can figure out how to actually make them, because at the moment, I will admit, I'm pretty darn confused, but I must admit, programming and coding seems pretty amazing to me, and I'd love to get in on that, it seems awesome. And I love games, so programming games seems even better. So thanks for watching. Have a nice day. I hate that leaf. It looks so odd. Um, <laughs> uh, like, comment, rate, subscribe, though I doubt any of you will. I doubt anyone will watch the video. Well, no, you know, pretty small channel. Maybe later on. Okay, I'll stop being distracted. Thank you.